Vince is on the phone with somebody saying he's on the way to the ring right now. He wants to make sure they give The Rock the proper treatment in the parking lot. Shane and Steph walk down to the ring. White Limo arrives. It is, in fact, The Rock. The proper treatment, I guess, is saying, oh, look, it's The Rock, and letting him walk into the building. So Vince comes out to the ring, and I'm very tired of this show, and I look down, and there's still 13 minutes to go. I can tell that I need to recap this, Vinny, because you clearly didn't like it. No. So Shane and Stephanie and Vince are in the ring, and Shane, they're both trying to convince The Rock to come with them. So Shane's argument, I'll cut to the chase for you, Vinny. Maybe you'll like it better if I cut to the chase. That would have helped a lot, honestly. He says, listen, Rock, you've been gone. The last three times that you were on WWF television, that man right there screwed you. That guy right there screwed you at WrestleMania. That guy right there screwed you at the last WrestleMania. If you come back to the WWF, that guy is just going to screw you again night after night. Not a bad argument. That's honestly a great argument. Vince then cut what was actually a great promo. He says, I have made many mistakes. Yes, I stood behind Steve Austin at WrestleMania. I should have known someday the snake was going to bite me, and it bit me. If you come back to WWF Rock... I have no intention of ever screwing you again, but I cannot guarantee that I will not screw you again because if it's best for business, if it's best for the WWF, I'm going to do what I have to do. But at least I'm being honest with you. And you, this is the devil you know versus the devil that you don't know. And you may never trust me again. That's fine. But trust yourself Trust these people. Your future is here with the World Wrestling Federation. I thought, God damn it, that was a fucking good speech from that fucker. He convinced me to go to the WWF. Then Shane does, Shane actually had a shitty rebuttal to that. He's like, well, you know, you're a progressive man, and this is a progressive yeah. organization. What the hell is he talking about? I'm like, that's what you came up with after that? That's why you're not a lawyer, buddy. So him and... Vince starts shoving each other, and Vince suddenly screams, Give the fans what they want! So the Rock grabs Vince, and he gives him the Rock Bottom. And everybody goes crazy because they saw Rock Bottom. And Shane's all happy, and he's running around the ring like an idiot. And all of a sudden, Rock looks at him. But Shane's an idiot. So he's like, Ha! This guy likes me! He offers his hand to the Rock. The Rock extends his hand. And then, of course, the Rock gives him the Rock Bottom. Now everybody's really losing their shit. I thought they were going to go off the air, making us wait till the next show to find out what The Rock was going to do. But instead, The Rock said, finally, The Rock has come back to the WWF. And the place goes crazy, and everybody's happy, and The Rock is back to save this fucking shitty show. They need saving. I liked it. The chasm between The Rock and the rest of the talent is massive. Well, there's Austin. There's, but aside okay. from that, there Austin's is a, one of a kind. giant chasm. Why did you scream that? I don't know. I was trying to think of another move, but or another <laughs> word. Abyss. You know what I'm saying? Abyss. The gap. <laughs> no, that's where you get jeans. <laughs> Not anymore. I liked it. Nah. The Rock's back. Thank God. The yes. Rock will bring life to this, this show for the short term. This on another show probably would have been fine. On this show, where I just badly wanted the show to end, it felt like a five-minute skit stretched out over 13 minutes. There was a sellout in the TV in the living room when The Rock was on the screen. See? Look at, the, look at what this man does. If you love these video clips, head down there to the bottom right-hand side of the screen and click Join. For just $7.99 per month, you get full access to all of the episodes. Over 300 at current count. Full-length episodes of The Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, and Figure Four Daily with both Lance Storm and Filthy Tom Lawler. You can also hit that subscribe button, and you'll always be alerted as to when new shows are available.